resort and take it from there we are we are i am on a journey to get this content for these new bathing suits because they gotta go they gotta sell like that's my main objective this whole entire summer so hopefully we get that done and everything goes off without a hitch see you guys at the resort or maybe let's see what kind of car we get I'm gonna like shoot out of here. Alrighty, my little place for the weekend. Hi, it's just me. Alright, guys. First things first, let's do a little bathroom tour because it's right here when you walk in. A soaking tub. Okay, as you may have heard, I want to eat locally, so I wanted to get information from a local. She's actually uh, from Dominican Republic, but she's going to give us some local restaurant ideas, so that's what I kind of want to do here, support the local business. And also, outfit of the day I have on, can I see my jacket in there? Can you pass me the jacket? You might be in a very good assistant right now. You aren't available. Alrighty, guys. This is the airport flow. show you guys my little closet set up when I get to my hotel room I actually like to hang my clothes up 
and we're only going to be here just a few days these are just a couple of little items that i have that are new a little zara a little afrm dress that i think is so cute these little gold pants i have for my bathing suit cover up goes with the new bathing suit bag hat purse and here i just wanted to stack my sunglasses I like to have them out. These are the sunglasses that I'll have in rotation. Little jewelry. That's about it. Prime example of how stuff gets started around here. We're watching the solar eclipse on television. And he says, we should take a trip. A trip to see the solar eclipse. That's how, where are you going to be in six days? That is exactly how stuff starts around here. And so now all I'm going to do is look on my calendar and see what i have to do in six days and if there's nothing on my calendar then we're going to and then there's some place like would you say cleveland cleveland ohio mm -hmm. i've been worse places <laughs> Okay, really, 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 really quick, guys. This fragrance right here, okay, it's a men's fragrance, first of all, but this fragrance right here, if you guys are interested in getting your man a cologne, a new cologne, I mean, it smells so yummy. It's, it turns head. It will have people asking, what are you wearing? What are you wearing? I think it's the perfect summer scent for a man. Mm, can you wear this in winter? Let me smell let me, I'm smelling you right now. I think you could wear it in winter if you kind of mix it with the oud or something. But if you want to just a simple fragrance that you can wear this summer, guys, 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 let me show you something. I'm going to try to take it out the box. 
I'm having trouble. Shucks. I'm trying to shake it off. Okay, okay. Any moment now. I'm trying. Oh, okay. Here it is. This one right here. Imagination by Louis Vuitton. <gasps> this stuff right here, guys, smells so good. So good. It won't focus. Where's the focus? Come on. Right there. Imagination. This smells so good. Like, wow. I hate the focus on this camera. It's like not, there it is. It's not giving. Now it's giving. Guys, this fragrance, the bee's knees. The bee's knees. The wind is winding right now, and but it's a good day. I mean, the sun is still shining. It's like a perfect. What about 79 degrees or so? 84, 84 degrees. It's like it's perfect, and the wind is mixed in with the 84 degrees. So. We're on island time. It's like three. It's after, definitely after three o'clock, and we just got to the beach. But you know, we're on no one's time but ours. So, hey, good. I don't know if you guys hear the music in the background, but it's giving island vibes. So, I want to, I want to show you guys the ocean. It's, it's, the waves are waving right now, and it's windy and.
honey, so I have my fan all at the beach because, you know, just in case I get hot, it's so damn windy. It's like perfect temperature. Like, I don't even need, I don't need this. I don't need this. Just got in from the beach. The wind was on hella high. It was so windy. So we're going to, I, I never take naps, but I need a nap. I think I've had too much Casamigos. <laughs> So we're gonna take a nap. Well, I'm gonna take a nap and get up and see if I can go to this local um, spot. It's called Captain something. I hope I can remember. Oh my God, a girl just told me what it was. But anyway, I'm gonna take a shower and, you know, boil up and take a nap. And I will hopefully see you guys at this local spot. If I can remember the name, but we can just drive there. All right, honeys, bye for now. So that shower was much needed and I'm just gonna do my little facial routine like I'm going to bed. It's actually nowhere near bedtime, but I need a nap. So hopefully I get up. <laughs> And I can go eat. Later. Oh my God, I feel so good. Do you guys spray uh, perfume on before you go to sleep? I do, even if it's just a sample. because I don't want to fall asleep and not wake up. I wash my hands when I'm doing my face like like after I feel like everything I put on wash my hands and this stuff is so good guys. Oh no 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 it's not I don't even I don't know what it is but between this come on focus hold on I know how to get it to focus Okay, between this stuff here, like, it's so good. It's just so good. And of course, my good jeans. I don't think I want to put good jeans on right just this moment, but I like to be all shiny and moisturized. So this stuff here, oh, did I should look, look at that. This is good stuff. So I'm gonna put this stuff on and moisturize and take a nap because I'm tired. I woke up, I went to bed at like 10.30. I probably didn't really go to sleep, but I went, to, I got in the bed at around 10.30 and I had to be, get up at 3 a.m. to catch my 5.02 a.m. flight. So I'm pretty freaking beat. I'm tired, I need a nap. I just feel like exhausted. I hate to take a nap because I'm probably gonna be up all night, which I'm on vacation, so it really doesn't matter. I can stay up all night. And do you guys watch Housewives of Potomac? Um, I actually interviewed for that show the second season. I didn't get it, I know I didn't get it, which I wasn't really trying to get it, but. That's, that's like a story time, guys. That's a story time. I'll tell that story one day. But as of right now, yeah, that, like, they get all in your business. So if you ain't ready to put it all out there, when I wasn't ready to put it all out there, like, you can't do those shows, which is why I don't. He's got a victim who's screaming her head off or screaming his head off, making lots of noise and motion, attracting attention. There's a good chance that threat's gonna get out of there. But, and this is a big but, in all the rest of those use of force situations, the only thing that could save the victim's life, or could have saved the victim's life, is if that individual was carrying a gun powerful enough to physically shut down an attacker as quick as possible. 
Okay, so when we carry concealed, it is critical that we understand that not all cartridges, not all calibers are developed to effectively stop human threats. Okay, we're just gonna get dressed really, really fast because I took more than a, what did I say, an hour or 30 minute nap. Anyway, it was way longer than that. So let's just get dressed. A lot of change of plans. We come downstairs to get the car and we called for the car and we got down here and we was like, hey, where's the car? And he was like, oh, let me run and go get him. We was like, oh, okay, because we called, you know, to get the car and we get here. He comes back to tell us that the car has a flat tire. So change of plans. I don't know what we're gonna do, but we have to call and I guess they have to come and fix the car. I don't know, but we were on our way to go to a restaurant to get dinner, but yeah, I don't know. We'll figure it out. Update, so we got the car fixed. He changed the tire. Actually, my assistant changed the tire said his honey muffin is hungry so he got that tire changed in like three minutes he got a, little the a little longer he got the tire changed and uh, the guy from the hotel helped him well, I don't know what y'all were doing back there but anyway they got the tire changed really 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 quick and we are here at mama mama's it had really good reviews so we'll see I don't it's a pizza joint he has to have pizza everywhere we go but he's not getting pizza I'm getting spaghetti I think and I think he's gonna get lasagna or something like that but at least we're out okay, so, uh, can I taste your lasagna I'm gonna taste the lasagna first
You're gonna like it. It's good. Now, I hate when I taste somebody else's food and their food is good and then I don't want mine anymore. It's cheesy. It's, it's really good. So, on the review, it said the lasagna was good? Yeah, it was good. Not as good as that, but it's good. It's good. Hello, Muni. Prends soin de ces gens-là, s'il te plaît. Ciao, ciao. A bientôt. <rire> Au revoir. Au revoir. A good morning. It's picture day, and I just woke up. It's like 9 a.m., and it is raining. Oh, my gosh. It wasn't supposed to rain. On the island, so hopefully we'll just stop shortly so we can get started. <gasps> All right. Uh, yuck. It's breakfast time. It's hot out here, and I'm having green tea, and it's hot. until golden hour. I don't know, we'll see, but we're gonna, we have to go return our rental car and get another rental car. So we're gonna do that first. And after that, I guess we'll just go on about our day. So I'll check back in after I get dressed. All right, fresh out the shower and let me show you guys. We got a little drone action. This little bad boy here. Can you work it in the room? Let me go up too fast. Ooh. Ooh. Oh my God. All right, bye. I'm gonna do a quick little face beat so that I can hurry up and get dressed. So we can go and exchange this rental car and then we're gonna go to the beach over there. And so hopefully I can get some really good footage at the beach. So let me just beat this face really, really fast, okay? Alrighties, I'm almost, I'm pretty much finished. I use my MAC Chestnut Liner, Anastasia of Beverly Hills Lipstick. Let me show you the color. I'll try to write the colors in there. It's like a nude, nudish color. And then I went over it with this gloss here. And use my milk makeup. I never hardly wear lashes, so I have on the lashes. And this one's actually kind of coming off. I'll work on this one and then voila, I'm gonna put on a gold bathing suit and we'll be finished. of the day. It's going to be gold, guys. This is the new suit. Ooh. 
let's go take some pictures. I'm gonna put my earrings on, but that's about it. They're long and gaudy, just like me. Just got out of the shower, face is just glistening. And you know what, it was just shiny. It just looked like a glass ball when I first got out of the shower because of my gel cleanser. But after my gel cleanser, I put on this little stuff here. It has the bean essence in it. Love it. And I just... And then it took that really, really shiny shine off. And it just gave me this little action here. And then I moisturize. I don't have all of my nighttime products, but... Then I use this. So these are the only two things I'm using tonight. And I'm just gonna go in 
go to bed and finish watching a Netflix show that we've been watching. It's been really cool and futuristic. Whoops. Futuristic and kind of like an AI. You know, everything is like going AI. So I guess we better get to the program because AI is not going anywhere. That's what I hear. Well, of course it's not going anywhere. So we're gonna have to find some kind of way to adapt to AI. All right, honeys, uh, good night. We gotta get up early tomorrow because breakfast is my favorite thing to do on a little vacay. Good night. There is a bar. 